guys, it's Phoenix K. Welcome to Let's Play Sonic the Hedgehog for Episode One. I'm very pumped to be starting this playthrough because you know this is a this is a pretty fun game. I tried to record this yesterday, but you know my commentary was just all out of whack, so I just said screw it. So yeah, this is uh the first entry into the Sonic into Sonic the Hedgehog 4, Sonic the 4, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 4 Episode 2 just came out, uh, came out the 16th, so it came out about 15, 16 days ago, and it was, um, it was really good, I really enjoyed Sonic 4 Episode 2, and I also really enjoyed this game when this first came out, and as you, and as you'll see, I played this game a crap ton of times. Now, I'm not gonna go for the Chaos Emeralds, just, it's kind of a waste of time to be, I mean, I like to use them, but I don't really want to mess with them, so, uh, let me see, Phoenix, Phoenix, yeah, I'm just gonna put my name in as Phoenix, just because, it's just to make sure I know it's my Let's Play file, because I usually always name them as Sam, or Practice, or whatever, so, there we go, Phoenix, and let's just get started. Start this thing up. So we're gonna start in Splash Hill Zone. This is uh, green, the Green Hill Zone of this game. Now be careful, because I remember I just had a friend who was playing. He got killed by that Moto Bug, which was pretty funny to watch. But yeah, um, but yeah. This is continue. This is uh, this takes place right after the events of Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Uh, and according to the Sonic uh, uh, Sonic 4 website uh sonic and knuckles story and sonic 3 and knuckles happen at the same time no they don't knuckles is easily takes place afterwards it just would not make sense you know i mean sometimes like a little bit of, like it depends on how far you play into the game uh to see like if they would play at the same time because if you because some stuff makes sense if they were at the same time, but then, like, the ending does not, like... So, Knuckles beats... It, it, it wouldn't make sense, because that would mean there are two Master Emeralds, and that... that there aren't two Master Emeralds, sorry. There's only, there's only one! Boom, boom. So, yeah, there's my little spiel on, spiel on that. Be careful, there's a Buzz Bomb right there, and a Buzz Bomb right there. I've gotten owned by him a couple of times. And I'm totally gonna skip that giant ring, even though it's very appealing. I remember once I was, like, back when I really wasn't good at the classics on the games, I played Sonic 1, I was like, HOLY CRAP, THERE'S A GIANT RING, AND I COMPLETELY MISSED TO GRID IT, I'M LIKE, OH MY GOD, IT WAS A GIANT RING! But I'm really happy that kept, uh, they keep the giant ring thing, I'm not a big fan of the ch whole checkpoint things. But yeah, so this is High Speed Athletics. You spawn a jump pretty high on this. I mean, pretty simple stuff. And yeah, it's best to homing attack these, uh, so you get a ton of speed going in. Oh, okay. But yeah, the homing attacks of this game. If you didn't already see that, but yes, the homing attack is in this game. It's pretty nice. I really enjoy uh, using the homing attack. Ow. Huh? What the heck? Okay, that was weird. But yeah, I really enjoy- I really like the homing attack and how it's used. If you- if you- you can air dash with it, which is pretty nice just to get your speed up. You know, which is nice. It's like- Sorry, but I had to take care of something. It's like, uh... It's like how- what's- it's like what the spin dash did in Sonic 2. And, and by the way, the spin dash is in this game. I'll show it off right now. Boom. It's it's not like the most helpful thing ever because the homing the homing uh, the homing attack is the strongest thing you have. So I mean, do what I do. If you like the spin dash, go for it. I mean, and be careful here. That I believe there's a huge spike pit coming up. And and uh, and. Uh, no, 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 okay. Alright, good. There we go. And that's it. 
Yeah, so you can press A to go to the next act. I'm going to do this in a linear order. I'm not going to just go all over the place. Because that would just be really confusing and hard to watch. And no, I got a minute 40 exactly. Pretty cool. Santa Dash. Now let's go. This is a nice song. But yeah, this is a very nice looking level. I mean, I don't know. The graphics are good for the most part. Granted, they're nothing compared to the ones in episode 2, but still. Yeah, jog up that hill, Sonic. Ah, okay, that was kinda cheap. But yeah, so... I just talk about something, so... We're not even in June yet, and I'm like... Seriously, just like the fact that I'm off of school is the greatest feeling in the world. And I checked my grazing crap, I mean, so they were all good, I used bees and stuff. Um... Ow! Yeah, so... Yeah, I mean... It, it'll, it'll definitely be a fun summer for all of us, because, you know, I'm Let's Playing, so... That should be fun, right, guys? Right, guys? Right, guys? <laughs> uh, but yes, um... Yeah, the speed shoes are back. They're pretty act. They're not... Alright, I have to... Alright. Make sure to homing attack these guys, because they have a really cheap placement with one of those bubbles. Just make sure to homing attack them all. They're really no It's really annoying. Because I've gotten, like, just... Ugh, it's terrible. And wow, we're already at 7 lives. I would not have 7 lives if I was playing Sonic 1 right now. I'm just letting you know, game, so... It's pretty uh, generous with the 1-ups, but hey, whatever. I'm alright with that, because, you know... A, g a game that's, like, super easy, like... I don't find diff- I don't count difficulty as, uh, a big part in games I like. I just love that. I almost jumped into that ring, but luckily Sonic's auto walk kicked in. But yeah. But yeah, I decided that I'm gonna do one zone a video. So this should be, like, five parts long or something. Just to, you know, keep it- keep it good. Keep it going good. Splash Hill Zone Boss, SHOWDOWN WITH DR. EGGMAN! And this is a, I believe it's, this was either a beta or a scrapped boss theme from, for Sonic 3D Blast. You know, I always freak out when I'm fighting this boss. Like, no matter what game I'm in, because, you know, I'm worried that I'm just gonna, he's just gonna kill me. And I don't want to get killed by the world's easiest boss. Ow! I do get hit by him though, so I mean. No! Ow! Ow! And booyah! Alright, good, 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 good. Yeah, I don't know why I always freak out when I'm fighting him, but I just don't want to lose, you know? Cause he, you know, he's kind of hard in this game, right? I mean, but no, but mainly, like, like I found the biggest Shrekker Wrecker, like, the most difficult one was the Sonic 3 Knuckles one against, um, when you fight, when you, when Mecha Sonic's ended, because his, the way the, the ball swings, it, yeah, the way the ball swings, it's pretty hard to avoid, but yeah, well, that's all for this video, uh, until then, I'm Phoenix K, uh, and next time we will tackle Casino Street Zone, see you guys then.